Group feels inspired. Want to just go morale and random skill gain? Yeah. Okay. Lewis's morale increases. Annette's morale increases. Lewis's mechanical increases. Arlene's medical increases. And its fitness increases and zombo points. <clears throat> Which, if you haven't tuned into our previous episodes, use those to get more skills for your survivors outside of a game. The group camps out in a big field, eat a decent meal. I think that was the last of our food. Find a row of cans sitting on a wooden fence. I don't want to lose the last of our bullets. Like we, okay. really, we don't really have a whole leave lot for other weapons. Yeah, leave the camp. Let's go. All right. I can't wait to fight some more zombies. Um, Shut up, Lewis. <laughs> Suddenly a giant fissure erupts across the road ahead. It's big. Super big. The asphalt buckles on either side, making for a pretty sick ramp. Uh, the car's already in pretty... What if we hurt ourselves? Well, the car's already in pretty shit condition, too. We uh, might... Or, well, how far are we down on gas, anyway? We've got quite a bit of gas. Do we want to lose the gas? <clears throat> I don't know. Gun it. YOLO! <laughs> Lewis grabs the wheel and pounds the gas pedal. The car bolts forward, ripping a howling screech into the sky. Lewis's morale increases, and apparently the dog's morale increases. The car <laughs> barely makes it, but sinks like an anvil and smashes into the ground. Chunks of the car fly in various directions. It took a beating, but it's still running. Holy shit! Danger zone! <laughs> <clears throat> We're out of food. Annette chews on a squeak toy. Lewis is a lightning rod, but for dogs. Another dog approaches the group. Fuck yeah! Jefferson. Yeah. Wow, this is interesting. Every... Fuck yeah! Cool, we have two dogs now. When driving on the death road, the group decides to make a stop for supplies. We can either go to a dangerous gas station rescue, a riled up apartment, or we can waste some gas and drive around looking for something better. Uh... We don't have a lot of weapons, so you want to just drive around more? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we can go to a stash in the woods or a grocery rescue. I almost want to play it safe and go stash in the woods. Let's play very safe. Yeah. I lost one of my good friends already. Okay, apparently Arlene's driving. All right. It's after, after dark. dark. Fuck. Okay, so someone's got to take a flashlight. Can the dogs carry flashlights at all? You know what? I don't really want to try it. Do you want to carry the flashlight? And I can... Focus on the combat. I'm not too sure which character I'm going to end up playing. I, I honestly just oh, kind right. of button playing, mash. Right, you were playing as a dog. I kind of button mash. Okay, all right. All right, stash in the woods. There, you're on. You were just on Arlene. Oh, I don't know what the fuck I'm. That's doing. a stick. That's a very dog-like thing to go after. Oh boy, stick. Stick, stick. Okay, stash in the woods. Oh. Oh, I don't know which character I am. There we go, it's kind of dark. Well, to be fair, you are playing as a dog. Um, there's like a floating skull over here. Isn't that like a zombo point? Oh, zombo point. Yep. Yes. Nobody died. That's a good thing. Give it time. Like, touch the skull and like, Lewis just like drops dead. <laughs> ah, demons! No, 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 no. Okay, so we got some food here. Okay, that zombie's down. More food. I'll break out the flashlight. So I attack the couch because I'm fucking blind. Pipe bomb. Please don't give the dog a pipe bomb. Bad things happen. Crunch, crunch, boom. What is that thing? Um, I'm we could probably up. get Arlene to pick it up. Can I drop? How many it? items can the dog hold? I put the pipe bomb back down. Let's just get Arlene to walk over it, and she'll she might pick it up. She's not picking it up. Am it Arlene? I'm just gonna swap items here. Give her the flashlight. And I'll get... Yeah, the dogs can only hold one item. Looks like Jefferson can just attack with his claw. He can't even pick up items. There, now Lewis has the pipe bomb. Okay, okay let's uh, check in here. Oh! It is gonna be getting even darker here, so we'll want to do this quick. <clears throat> Magical wishing toilet. Oh, he just got an achievement. Magical wishing toilet. There's a genie here. When Lewis opens the toilet, a magical genie appeared. Thanks for freeing me from the shit. Hold on, toilet. It says, now make a wish. Lewis makes a wish. Do we want to be rich? Do we want immortality? Or are you one of those evil <laughs> genies? 
I don't know, immortality sounds good. Sounds pretty damn good. Lewis stares in horror as his skin turns to stone, trapping him in place forever as a statue. No, wait, it just kind of turned his skin gray. Lewis's vitality increases. Is it an evil genie? I don't know, but I think Lewis might be, like, not human anymore. Wow. Well, we got the magical wishing toilet. Shall we get out of here now? That night at the stash in the woods changed Lewis forever. Sorry, Lewis. Looks kind of rad, though. Don't, don't say sorry. He's like a superhero now. Okay, did all of us get out of the car? Or out of um, the... yeah. Okay. Yeah, we got some supplies. We're, I think we're good to go. Good. Oh, balls. Go, 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 go. I don't think that car is going to last much longer. It's smoking. Jeez. I think smoking like a Canadian backyard barbecue. That's how you know it's a good barbecue. <laughs> the group finds a cabin in the woods with no zombies in sight. It has a wood stove in it, but no wood. The group is low on food and eats less. Morale decreases. Jefferson's a sad dog. Well, do we want to go out and chop wood or we want to just go to sleep? Mm, I think we should chop wood. Who should go chop wood, Lewis or Arlene? Because the dogs can't do it. Send Arlene to do it. She's not important. Wow. Kind of savage, babe. Well, Arlene chops a bunch of wood and gets the wood stove going before passing out. She'll be very tired tomorrow. Her strength increases slightly. The fire feels great. And some people's morale increase. 11 driving days till Canada. We're down to one can around you. Molotovs are very dangerous. Let's not mess with them. Nonsense. Those are everybody's friend. <laughs> It's so quiet. It I can't talk. It's so quiet here. There's no signs of life or unlife. Seems like everyone took what they could and evacuated this town immediately. Do we want to scavenge it or loot quickly and run? If they evacuated immediately, maybe that means it's potentially <clears throat> dangerous. Yeah, loot quickly and run. Let's do it. The group does a quick search of most obvious places and finds some ammunition. I was hoping for some food. Mm. Man, Lewis is like. Mm. Is Lewis like a statue person now? The car has completely run out of gas and coast to a stop. You guys are walking. The fuck? Oh, balls. The group runs into a particularly rough stretch of road. There's nothing life-threatening about it. Just a long and miserable walk. They get bruised and battered in multiple small accidents. Accidents? Hmm. Like they trip and fall? But that's the only explanation I can come up with. Maybe Lewis is like a statue person now and when he like steps, the road just like cracks. <laughs> He's like the thing from the Fantastic Four. Oh, man. Uh-oh. Okay. Don't worry, guys. We can still make it. Group spots an old boot on the road. It doesn't look like it's anyone's size, but hey, it's free. This is surely a symbol of good luck. Get the boot? Get the boot. Okay. What the fuck was the point of that? What? The group walks to the entrance of a dark tunnel filled with cars. There has to be some gas and a working car in there. Also, lots of zombies that you can't escape from easily. Current time oh, is nightfall. Fuck. Oh, balls. Oh, we have... Oh, it's a throwing boot. Oh, okay. Okay. We have two pipe bombs. Yeah, I think I'll take the pipe bombs in. Just... Ugh, we don't have a whole hell of a lot. Are you playing as the dog again? I'm, I told you I button mash. I end up on something. Okay. I can try to stick with somebody who's got opposable thumbs. Oh, they both have the same thing. Um, okay, let's, uh... I'm gonna pull out the gun. I'm getting the gun! Alright, let's just run through. Uh -oh. Careful. I think my umbrella broke. Ah, gasoline! For days, yo! Come on, Lewis. Be a cowboy. I'm a cowboy. On a steel horse I ride. I'm wanted. Wanted. <laughs> Break out the Bon Jovi. Wow, that was not as bad as I thought it would be. Okay. Holy. Don't jinx it, man. Um, let's just go back quick and just see if we missed anything in these cars back here. Um, Are you sure you did? Let me just take a quick peek. Were there any cars back here? Uh... 
Ah, uh, fuck that. Never mind. Sorry, I... I was so focused on the zombies. Sometimes when you come into these tunnels, there's like a lot of cars and you can actually like siphon gas from them and stuff. So that, you know, beneficial. Well, is this a working vehicle? It is. Yeah, that's the vehicle we were going for. Okay. Stop being an asshole and drive. All right, we got a new set of wheels. Nice blue car. Mm-hmm. While driving on the death road, the group decides to make a stop for supplies. Why does everything have to be dangerous? <laughs> Alright, what are we picking, babe? Oh, jeez. Uh... We could drive around again, because we just got a new car. We got like 80-something gas. Frankly, I'm kind of tired of dying before we get to Canada. I want to go as far as we can. I'm sure everybody's tired of dying before they get to Canada. <laughs> The group decides to burn some gas. Want to go to a fancy office? Yeah, sure. Alrighty. Group sees an office. We're just trying to play it safe. I think I'm going to put these pipe bombs back because it's supposed to be a moderate horde. Mm -hmm. You're just playing as whoever. I kind of want to try this throwing boot out. I wonder if it like comes back to you or something. Cause every, like a boomerang? Yeah, because every other like non-wielding item you just pick up and then it, you throw it and it goes back down. So hmm. what happens with the boot? Actually, I'll keep the gun. We'll take the frying pan off. And if I lose the boot, I'll just look for another melee weapon. Hopefully like a stick of wood or something. Yeah. All right. Let's check out the fancy office. Which one am I? Oh, yes. Motherfucking superhero. Where am I? Um, oh, you throw the boot and you have to pick it back up. That's interesting. No, 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 no. I think I'm one of the dogs again. Yay, button mashing. Are the dogs meat shields? Oh, the dog picked up the boot. Bad dog. This was not a game of, this was not a glorified game of go, go fetch. There we go. The only problem with using this boot as a weapon is the dogs will friggin' pick it up. He picked it up again! But then he throws it and I can pick it up. It's like we're taking turns. Alright. Nothing in this room, I don't think. Well, lots of chairs to throw. Let's go down here. Oh. So all Lewis has is a gun now. I think the throwing boot is lost to us. I should not have gone with the, gone with the throwing boot. Go, Lassie! Kill those rotters. Right. Shit, Lewis has got to find a chair. Oh, that sucked. This place is a mess of tables. Well, it is an office building. That's what you get. Yeah. This is true. Okay. Let's see what's door? up here. Yeah. Ooh. Where am I? Where am I? Rely on the chairs. They'll save your life. It's too heavy. Can't have more than four people on a team. Lewis could just round up like an army of dogs. <laughs> Come to me, my jungle friends. <laughs> just like Ace Ventura. That's another movie series we gotta watch, babe. Mm -hmm. Ace Ventura. Whoop. This safe is locked, closed. Too straight to destroy. Need to find a combination or a key. Okay. Oh, there's some, uh... There's gas up there and there's also a piece of wood. I'm gonna grab the golf club. Just because Lewis don't got any weapon right now. Oh, sorry, that wasn't gas. That was ammo I picked it up. Oh, gosh, the dog has a gun. Oh, boy. Dog's like, I'll use this thing, man. Think I'm playing? I've seen some shit. Not all dogs go to heaven. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess we'll just keep an eye out for that combination then. What about in here? Now, if we were IT folks working in a fancy office, where would we hide the combo? Eat it. Eat it? Yes. That, but how, how would you go to look at it again? Oh, I don't want to <laughs> Don't answer that question. The only problem with golf clubs is they don't last very long. Although they will last longer than some weapons that break in like two hits. Anything down there? Nope. Nope. Let's go. 
Okay. This is a pretty big place. We're just going to have to retrace our steps and come back here. I think there was a door. Yeah, there was a door over here we hadn't checked. Oh, there's a key. There was? Yeah. Not too sure. Wait. Oh, there it is. Okay. It's like some Legend of Zelda stuff, man. Oh, ba 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 Louis. 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 Fuck. <laughs> Louis picks the fancy key up. I got some gas. All right, let's just get out of here. Boogie. Run, bitch. Run. Get back up here. Eh, eh, you left us behind, you son of a bitch. There's nothing in there. Don't worry. The dogs will find the way. All right. Get in there. All right. Lewis unlocks and opens the safe, along with some now useless papers. Oh, we get to pick. Either as a container of 80 gas, a hunting rifle... Cowboy rifle and 30 ammo, or a magnum and 36 bullets. Magnum is a kind of pistol. We already have one pistol. Well, we have a Dolt 45, what a Colt, whatever. That's basically a kind of pistol, yeah. So we have pistol ammo. Should we get the cowboy rifle with the corresponding ammo? I'm leaning towards that, too, because we don't have a cowboy rifle yet. No, or, All any, right. or any rifle. We're in agreement? Okay. Let's do it. Yeehaw. Um, there we go. So I've got a golf club. Cowboy rifle and adult. Back off, man. This dolt causes brain cancer and I'm not afraid to use it. Okay. Um I'm curious, did we miss any rooms? Is there anything else? We got ammo and whoops. We gotta go up this way. Um bah, 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 bah. Yeah, watch for their uh, outlines there on the outside of the room. If you're near a doorway, you can kind of see them coming. All right, which way do we have to go? Let's go out this way. Let's just see if we missed anything. Oh, yeah, we got a door up here. And of course, we can shut the door. Let's clean house. That is a retro-looking fridge, eh? No, 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 no. It kind of looks like the fridge you see at the uh, Tommy Guns barber shops, eh? I suppose. Yeah. I guess you don't go to get your hair cut there since it's a men's barber shop, but... Alright. Uh, was that everything? Uh, let's check down here. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. Alright, well, it is getting dark, so let's boogie. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, yes, we are still low as fuck on food, but... We're alive. Wonder how bad they have it on the west coast. Oh, and Arlene's using some first aid stuff. Group continues making progress along the death road. As long as one person remains alive, the dream of Canada lives on. You have six food left. Would it be funny if just like one of the dogs made it? <laughs> how on earth would they drive? The dog is the real here. Oh my gosh, I kind of want to... I hope... That no offense to Lewis and Arlene, I kind of hope that happens. All right, well, we're at a trader camp. Let's see if we can, uh, let's see if any of our survivors... Oh, look, it's uh, D-Bar. David D-Bar? Mm -hmm. He has been waiting for you to show up. He has a mysterious past, and he's ultra fit, too swole. So do we want to recruit him? Yeah, we've got three randoms on the team, so uh, we can either keep the dogs or we let go of one dog. Okay. Recruit David. Do you want to get rid of Jefferson? Because his morale's pretty shit, and I don't think he can even pick anything up. Alrighty. Sorry, Jeffers. Bye, Jefferson. Go live among the foxes and the squirrels. Eat them. Okay, we got David on the team. David has appeared in a previous run, but the game, sometimes people that we've run into before will show up again. We just go by the house rules that we will keep as many familiar players on our team rather than randos. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Two cans of food. I don't want to give away. Some of these things are just not worth it. The problem is we just, we don't have, like, I just find that when you come to these trader camps, you just never have enough food. Yeah. Yeah, no. Okay. One well, hit the road. I suppose, well, it looks like David has a frying pan. Yeah, let's hit the road. 
Uh, I'm fun, giant bitches. Yeah.